So what's up? What's been? How's the back and neck? Back's been pretty good. Yeah. Um, Do you mind if Monica films anything for no, me? Thanks. Um, so I initially scheduled this because I've been having uh, issues with. I have a really tight adductor and okay. I'm getting pain like really, really low in my uh, okay. tailbone. Yeah. But it's only when I work uh, like left side lower body. Okay. So I initially booked for that. Okay. But then the next day I was doing shrugs and I ruined my back. Or like my neck. Upper, upper neck, yeah. So it's, it's been getting better, but I'm still like it hurts to like look and tilt that way. Okay. So that's like more of an issue for me at the moment. I, all right, so that's the take care of this and then Sweet. we'll figure this out. Yeah. Okay, we can do that. All right, so that'll be easy. Okay. What, um, so what's been going on down here? It's mostly a split squat, but only when I'm working the left leg. Okay, all right. And I have to have weight on it. Okay, how much weight? Not, not a lot. Yeah. Like, uh, and I can, I can go heavy, it just hurts. Okay, gotcha. Let's see, have you been doing a lot of like split stance training? Um, we were a while ago, yeah. but it, it, hurt. it was hurting before that, like I couldn't okay. walk. Okay. I got to a point where if my left leg was behind me, it hurt to like bring that leg in front. Got it, okay, yeah. cool. All right, taking any hard falls lately? I've got what I can think of, nothing like out of the ordinary. Yeah, um, nothing. My work is like lighter than normal at the moment. Okay, Yeah. nice. Cool. Let's see a step back lunge. With the right leg? Yep. Cool. Any pain? No. All right, other side. How's that? No Okay. Okay. No pain on either ones. Do you have, do you feel the adductor tightness? Uh, no. Okay. Show me the stretch that you would normally do that would feel it. Um, if I'm like getting down low here. Okay. Full class act. Gotcha. Uh, and normally it's just because I'm so flexible and with everything that I do in the ring, like I can't control it. Yeah. So I know that's bad. Yep. Okay. We'll work on that. I'll help you control some of that motion that you need. Um, all right. And then with the split, were you just split like this or were you elevated with the back foot? Uh, no, just split. Just split like yep. this? Okay. Um, let's come over here and throw a bar on. No pain. All right, just keep. Just give me a few. And when you were doing it, you were doing the full step back. Yes. Okay, so we're doing the lunge. Got it. At the moment, though, uh, we've got this new thing at work, so I don't yeah. put weight on my back. It's called a pit shark. I don't yep. Know yep. That's what I'm using. Okay. Cool. All right, and then the other side. Yeah. 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 Because And so when you say you had six plates, that was with the pit shark. Got it. Starting to feel it there. All right, give me a few reps. Okay. Okay, other side. Do you feel anything there? I do, it's just not as bad as the other side. Okay. All right, rock, go ahead and rack it in. Let's work. I'm gonna work down from there. Now, has it gone away? I can still feel it, but it's definitely... So it's there now? Yeah. All right, so now do, uh, without this, just body weight. Let me see. Does it, is it still sticking around? Do you feel it now? Not, not, not really? Not okay, back here. All good? Or do you feel it back? I feel it. It's, it's back not, again? Yeah. Okay, so, but we're like right on the edge of it? Yeah. Got it. Cool. All right, that's what we need. All right, come on over here. All right, flip. Let's check the other side. Feels fine. Okay. So don't think it's coming from your SI joint, so that's good. Now, when you feel it, does it feel like nerve? It's like pressure. Pressure. Like it's gonna like crack. Got it. All right. Interesting. All right, on your back. 
How's that? That's fine. All fine. Okay, stand up for me. And bend backwards for me as far as you can. Do you have any pain there? No. no. My neck. <laughs> Just the neck. Okay. And twist for me. All good? Yep. Another way? All, All good. good. All right. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Yeah, that is. Weird, huh? It is weird. All right. All good. Okay. Push out here. No pain? Nope. Okay. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All right. I'm working on your neck because I need time to think. We were living under small town lights Doing whatever that we felt right Living bigger than the money we had Didn't know that we were living too fast We were looking at our drinks half glass We would drink them just to have half chats Only talking with the troll half past Should've known at the time that we wouldn't last Now we don't chat, no we don't talk And now I laugh thinking about my younger thoughts Thinking we were in love Drank till we were too drunk Thought that we had it planned out Thought we'd never grow up Thought the world was against me I still think it was But now I know that's how it goes Having big dreams in your yard uh, uh. And relax And then relax and try and go a little bit further Good. All right, and then come out of it. All right, now show me how far you can go. There we go. <laughs> okay, so you can do that on your own. Okay. Like, like you just reach over with this hand, and then you find your point, yeah. right? You back out of it slightly, and then you just press against your own hand. Okay. okay. So what you're doing is you're just going to free up some of these muscles so those okay. joints can glide a little better, okay. and you're not going to pinch down as much there. Okay. Same thing with rotation. Uh -huh. You look that, you look this way as far as we can go, which is our, that's the one that we spent most of our time on, right? But it will, it's probably gonna stiffen back up because okay. you strained a muscle in here called yeah. levator scap. Okay. So it is strained, so it's probably gonna stiffen up. It's gonna feel the worst in the morning. Yeah. Hot shower's gonna feel awesome, okay? okay? Um, I'll show you a little lacrosse ball release you can do on it. Yeah. Um, but okay. like that, and then rotate as far as you can, find your point, and then just, rotate back into your hand all right just like you were kind of rotating into mine yeah. right just right here press and then see if we can get a little further okay okay mm -hmm. and i'll open it up for you um how long do you think yeah. i'm so little um like now that you're going to be working on it a few yeah. days okay yeah but um should be good by i'm going to say maybe residual by monday okay. but for the most part you should you shouldn't be limited in your motion okay. by Monday. I think I've been like yeah. doing these ones. Mm -hmm. Just because I'm scared of yeah, So the thing about these things is that the more motion you have, the better it's going to feel. The less motion you have, the worse it's yeah. going to feel. So I want you to use whatever you have. Okay. okay? Right. Don't be afraid to kind of just touch it yeah. and come back because you're not like hurting yourself further to touch it. Yeah. Just but you are gonna keep it kind of looser. So okay. like now that we have this, yeah. make it a point to kind of, just kind of take okay. your head over there. Cool. Make it a point to kind of look over your shoulder a bit, All find right. where your point is, and then it's just gonna keep it there for you for the okay. rest of the day. All right, uh, throw your shirt on and let's come back over here. I wanna take a look one more time at this. I want you to focus on really gripping the ground here and tightening up everything super slow, get into this position. And then I want, and then we're just gonna go straight up and down from here. Okay. There, and straight up. I wanna see if that causes any issue. And we're gonna go left foot forward. So let's just step back kind of into the split squat position. There you go. Tighten everything up here. Tighten up here, grip the ground, and now just drop into the split squat. Do you feel the pain there? Okay, again, okay, 
take a bit of a bigger step for me because you have all that mobility. Let's use it. Okay. Any pain there? Uh, tiny bit. Tiny bit. All right. I want you to try and there you go. Tuck that. Tighten up there. Go down. Better or worse? Uh, yeah, better. Same? Better. Okay. Let's make sure you're tucking that. Good. Go. Keep this glute squeeze the whole time. Okay. So. There you go. Tuck, tuck, tuck. Keep that glute squeeze. All good? Yeah. All right, walk it in. All right. Yes. So it's because you're not, I'm not letting you default into your anterior tilt that you, that you like to be in so much. I um, mean, your posture is even there. Oh, I thought it was better. No, it, but that's fine. Like, yeah. it's okay for you to, it's okay for this to be your posture, but you have to know that, when, that whenever it comes to, it's time to go and put weight on your back or use the pit shark or whatever, that you, it's one thing that you need to think about is organize yourself a little bit better okay. so that you're, because if you think about the way, if you're like this and then you're going back further and then as that hip flexor gets tight going down, then you're going to get drug even yeah. further for it and I can feel that pinch right there. Yeah. So you set it in, yeah. okay, and then bring it through. Yeah. Um, and then the pit shark is the cables even pulling you that way. So we have that, right? So then you're, it's even more that you have to fight. All right. So let's, um, throw another 10 on cause I'm 90% sure this is our issue. All right. There you go. All right. Tighten this up, push out against me. Like you're gonna get punched in the stomach. There you go. That's what I want and go. There you go. Push out against me. Are you going to get punched? Any pain? The slightest. Okay. You can walk it in. Nothing like it was though. Okay. And we're getting to that point where you're a little shaky in your technique there anyway. Yeah. Um, what do you, when you, are normally bracing your core. Are you trying to draw in, trying to suck your belly in? All right, so that's hollowing. The difference between hollowing and bracing is you're going to have much more stability when you brace, okay? So I don't want you trying to kind of suck in. It's great for pictures, not so good for lifting weights. All right, mm -hmm. so brace, hit, like I said, like you're gonna get punched in the stomach instead of going in, if you were getting punched, you wouldn't suck in and try and just absorb it, right? You're going to lock down and not let it happen. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm. okay? I think we talked about that last time yeah. you were here, too. I'm always, I'm always told that. Yeah. yeah. I feel like it's a, like a habit from a dance for so long. Now. It it's absolutely like is. In and go up, but I know what you mean. Like it absolutely is. And I think it's still, it's not being taught as much here in the States anymore. I don't know, it might still be, I don't know if being over in Australia, it's being taught as much, but, um, but yeah, in dance, I know everything is up like this. Yeah. So we just have to kind of break some old habits. Yeah, totally. Um, and it's just the difference in what you're doing. You know, if you were dancing, you'd probably be okay. Yeah. And you want to do this and you want to go get slammed on a mat, yeah. need a little more stability. Yeah. Like, cause I know it and I just don't do it. Yeah. So I need to just but it'll, it'll automatically, yeah. um, change things for you. Thinking we were in love, drank till we were too drunk, but now I know that's how it goes, having big dreams with your young.